This method represents a portion of a larger ex situ conservation breeding protocol used for laboratory mass production of at-risk butterflies. It illustrates how basic husbandry methods can be adapted for scientific research to help address key behavioral, life history, or ecological data gaps. The specific methods presented for assessing larval development time and the number of larval stadia have broad applicability to other butterfly conservation breeding or research programs. This technique is an effective approach for documenting the life history metrics of an endangered butterfly, such as number of larval instars, duration of developmental stages, and size of all life stages. We have streamlined our protocol so that productivity and efficiency may be increased in the laboratory, which is especially important when collecting data in a short time frame. This method requires dexterity and attention to detail to avoid organism harm, as butterfly larvae are very small, especially as neonates. Demonstrating the procedure will be Jacob Hornfeld, an undergraduate from our laboratory. To begin, use a small camel hair watercolor paintbrush to carefully move and isolate a single larva and place it under a dissecting microscope in a petri dish. Dip a single hair of the insect pin in non-toxic luminous paint of contrasting color to that of the larva and carefully put one small drop of paint on the back of the larva. After 30 seconds, the paint dries. With the help of a small camel hair watercolor paintbrush, place each individual larva in its own two ounce clear plastic portion cup containing approximately one to three small leaves of fresh terminal host material.